So this is the 2023 Mirai from Toyota. I'll just show you the energy information. So this is a fuel cell EV car. So it's using oxygen in the air combined with hydrogen in its fuel tank to create electrical power to power the electric motor. And the exhaust is water. So because this is a fuel cell EV, it is an EV car, so it does have the instant torque ability. So if I floor the gas pedal, hydrogen gas pedal, the fuel cell should activate. So right now it's inactive. Then if I floor it, the fuel cell, the water droplets there are the emission of the fuel cell. So when it feels that it needs to take out water from its tank, then it will have some water drops. So I like to apply brake mode, which is the BR on the right side there. Brake mode kind of applies what would be an engine brake if you were in a combust internal combustion engine vehicle, regular vehicle. So it applies like a profile to the electric vehicle to kind of simulate engine braking. And that way you can get into the regenerative braking more. So if you look on the left, there's a CHR for charge. So that's charge for your battery. So if I apply the engine brake, it will apply the regenerative braking there. And it does have regenerative braking even when BR mode is not on. It's just kind of more aggressive when it is. So there's those water droplets. And then the interesting about the fuel cell EV is that it does use the fuel cell to do some air purification. Uh, there's a filter on the front of the fuel cell to intake clean air. And so if I take this turn, you can see the air purification value go up because it is using the fuel cell to purify the air to generate the electrical power for the EV. For the, sorry, for the battery.